Here we go with Wednesday uh, warm up. This is going to be all body weight with your mobility complex. So I'll show you what I mean by that offset squat. You got Tabatas for your Wednesday workout. We're going to start each section with a Tabata. So that's 20 on, 10 off times eight. Then you'll have six minutes to do as many rounds as you can. So you're going to start with your ski erg, 20 on, 10 off, and you have a dumbbell uh, station with a bench. And then you're gonna go to uh, two with the rower and a Swiss ball, then the station three, again, 20 on, 10 off, and then you'll have six minutes to do the four exercises, 90 seconds in between stations. All right, I'm gonna do this real quick before the noon class comes in. So what I, that offset push-up, what I mean by that is you want one hand high, one hand low. You can offset that, one hand high, one hand low. You have one hand in, one hand out, all right? So just kind of mix it up a little bit, just get the, Arms loosen up a little bit. I'm uh, gonna let you know it now. All right, so dumbbells. We have our uh, alternating one arm bench press. So two ways you can do it. You can start up here, right? Alternate this way. All right, ten of them. So five each side. If you want to hang out down low, you can do that and do five and five. Just alternating back and forth. Um, Bend over, one arm row, it's only five aside, right? You got six minutes to get these in, so get nice and heavy with that. Uh, the eccentric, what I call this, the um, eccentric, eccentric, eccentric leg drop. All right, so now hold on to that bench. We're trying to get up, watch out for that. As high as you can, and then slow. So don't do that on the bench that can move. All right, we'll try this again on this side. Try that again on here, down the end. All right, for real this time. So you want to get up and then slowly let those legs drop. Okay, now that's using a lot of uh, back and a lot of core. That's too much to get your hips off the bench. And just swing up and then you can kind of slowly let the legs down. That way, if you're at the end of the bench, you can go down pretty far. Kick them back up, make just a little hip raise as much as you can. Then drop the hips and slowly let those go. Woo. Yeah, that's good. One. And then we got the dips. Alright, that's that station. So that station's gonna start with your skier, 20 on 10 off, get right to your work. Six minutes to get as many rounds in of those four exercises. 90 seconds, so if you want to finish up uh, whatever exercise you're on, it should be fine. Then we're gonna go over to the rower and mini bands. So pull out the mini bands out, get the band just above the knee. We're gonna do hip raise, so we got shoulders on the ball. So with that band just over the knees, you wanna open that band up. So for pressure, so the glutes are doing a lot of work. So we're squeezing, all right, it's only 10 reps, so nice and slow and controlled. Then we do hamstring curls, right? So same thing, kinda of open up those hips, uh, open up those knees a little bit, squeeze, and keep your glutes engaged as you keep those hips up. Then we're gonna go body saw. Again, keep the band on the whole time if you can. We're gonna go back and forth for one. So 10 of those, and then we got the old J5 the tapes. We're gonna sit, we're gonna have the band over the knees, all right? We're gonna abduct. We're gonna kind of open up, open up, close, close, and alternate so you open, open, close. Come on, I have to hold the band so it doesn't exfoliate the legs. All right, down, down. So that is your, you can, you can open up as well, keep your kind of feet there and do that if you want to, but we'll try both ways, see how that goes. That is your four exercises for the Swiss ball and the rows. Then the bike is going to be with your kettlebell. Uh, I've done this in the past, can't remember exactly what we call it, but we're going with the sumo twist knee drop. All right, that, back. And fourth, you got 10 of those, five each side, single leg, RDL, out of side, one arm, overhead. Anyone that has shoulder issues or this doesn't feel good or uh, alternate, alternative to the one arm overhead sit up, you can do a pullover. If you want to do that instead, that's fine. You get 10 of those or five each side of your um, uh, one arm overhead sit ups. All right, and the last one in this set is going to be your groiner with your over, uh, groiner with a high pull. All right, so if you get the big kettlebell, uh, you might be able to put your hands on it, otherwise hands can be on the ground, right? So do a groiner, and high pull. Pop, pop, up, oh, that's gonna be fun. That's the bike. Last, slams, 
This is going to be your fourth Tabata station. So for 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, slam, slam, slam. All right. And then we are going to go with, check this one out, alternating slasher to halo. So you want a pad for your knees. So we're going to start with the ball by the hip, by the knee on the ground. The other knee is up, slash it a halo, and then switch knees. All right, you got that one? Some people might want to just keep both knees on the ground and do slash it a halo, that's fine. But with that knee switching, a little coordination involved with that one. I like it. Knee hug press, knee hug press. Ten of those. One arm inverted rows, it's been a little while, but we're or lean back, right? You can touch that ground, right? Pull yourself up and reach. Five side. And you're gonna finish this set with box jumps. Four regular box jump, two inside lateral box jumps, and we're bringing back one legged box bar. For those who can, if anyone is got knee issues or concerned about any twisting or if it's too much, just stick with regular box jumps. But I want to give that shot. So one legged box, we're gonna. Here we get a box. Good thing I have a plethora of boxes. All right? So, here, one leg, we're jumping, landing on that same leg if you can. That's a little tricky, so you're just doing one on each side, see how that feels. All right? You can do more if you want. If you want to do less regular box jumps, more one legged box jumps, go for it. But I think that's everything. Sorry, no puppies in this video, but we are posting pictures soon they are going to get adopted i'm not ready to give them up yet though so i would love for friends to adopt them wink wink nudge nudge know what i mean that way i can visit them always and forever thanks guys